This is Port Ellen and its ferry terminal and marina. It is the largest town on Isla, only slightly larger than Bamor, and provides the main ferry connection between Isla and the mainland. The town is named after the wife of its founder, Walter Frederick Campbell. We were able to visit all nine working distilleries on the island of Isla. Our first day, we hiked along the coast to visit the first three. La Froig, Lagavulin, and then finally, Ardbeg. We then took a bus to the airport where we rented a car and drove to the other parts of the island, first visiting Bamor, then across the bay to Brucladic then to the far side of the island to Kielholmen. We rounded out our tour the second day visiting Manahaven, Kaolilla, and Ardnaho. During our drive we encountered many single track roads. We felt fortunate when we found the main highways with two tracks. On more than one occasion, we encountered cows. Apparently, they don't bother with fences. And it seems like the cows like to use the roads just as much as we do. I think this baby wants to get a drink of milk. At the top of the hill here in Bamor sits the Round Church. It was built in 1767 and has a highly unusual circular design. It has been suggested that the circular design was intended to ensure that there were no corners in which the devil could hide. Bamor is a small town situated on the shores of Loch Eindal and serves as administrative capital of the island. It is an early example of a planned village with wide streets on a gridiron pattern. Its construction was initiated in 1770. 